It was June when London's famous Millennium Bridge was open to the public for the first time after its construction for the past two years. People have been eagerly waiting for the completion of the construction of this iconic bridge. So, when it was opened, the bridge was built for pedestrians only to cross the River Thames in London. But as soon as people started walking on it, the Millennium Bridge began to sway badly for the first two days. The police stopped everyone from climbing on the bridge. But after two days, it was closed again for the next two years. All the engineers who made it sat together and asked how such a strong bar could be moved only by the walking of people. The reason was something that the engineers had not been able to predict before, some 192 years ago in 1831. Some soldiers of the British Army paraded in Broughton, Northern England. The Proton Suspension Bridge collapsed due to the synchronization of the footsteps of the soldiers who were passing over the suspension bridge, in which 60 soldiers fell into the river and suffered serious injuries. But from that day onwards, the British Army gave instructions to its soldiers that they would not pass together and parade when crossing any bar. Rather, it is followed in some places to this day. It was the soldiers whose unison steps brought down the Broughton Suspension Bridge. Walking people are not soldiers, but why their footsteps are so synchronized in their step-ups, and why this modern footbridge built in the 21st century could not bear their synchronization. In 1665, a famous Dutch physicist, Christian Wurgens, built the world's first pendulum clock. His purpose was to tell sailors at sea. Where they were at that time, they used to guess by looking at the position of the sun or stars. But it was only a guess, it would know the latitude. But if they knew the exact time, it would also give them the longitude. It turns out that the clocks of this era were either forward or backward by 15 minutes a day, i.e. they were useless for this task. The plan was to hang the pendulum clocks in a ship with heavy weights. Check these pendulum clocks to do this. Huygens first hung the two blocks from a piece of wood in his house and started the two blocks one at a time. But after a while he noticed that the two clocks were synchronized in the left-handed clocks. Pendulum. Hoguns did not understand this strange behavior of the clocks. He again shook the movement of both clocks. But after 30 minutes they both synchronized with each other again. The Huygens thought that there might be a collection of air pressure between them. So they placed a cardboard between the two clocks, but after two minutes, the clocks were back in sync with each other. He separated the two clocks from each other, hung one from a chair and the other from another chair. Then he noticed that the inaudible connection of the clocks was now broken. But when they were both hanging from the same wood, if 30 tomatronums are placed on a table, and started at different times, that is, their starting is not synchronized. But after only two minutes, you can see that it is 30 to matronos. 30 to matrons are amazingly synchronized. Research has noticed that when fireflies are together, they shine and sync in all the ups, but for this, one fireflies must be so close to the other, so that his flash can reach the others. If they are far away in the air, the synchronization of their flashing will be broken. In the same way, we humans also synchronize with each other in many ways. In this video, audience are clapping for a performance. You can see that no one told these people to do this, but still they all matched their clap frequencies with each other. This phenomenon of synchronization is not limited to one or to objects, so our heart runs in sync with our body. A normal person, if he runs fast, his heart rate will immediately increase along with it, because the heart has to deliver oxygen-rich blood to the bloodstream. But if there is a problem in the heart, if it happens, its synchronization does not match with the body. It is also called a regular heartbeat or, in medical terms, a rhythm in this condition. The heart rate increases on its own, now the heart is pumping more blood. Yes, but the lungs are not giving them more oxygen. So will the brain get more blood and less oxygen, and in this situation, the person may die. 
That is, less synchronization is harmful, but more synchronization can also cause problems. When it started, the steps of enough people became synchronized with each other. The design of the Millennium Bridge was such that its cables supported the bridge from the side and not from the top. Civil engineering and especially structural engineering. The rule is that while designing the footbridge, its resonance frequency is not kept equal to the frequency of human steps. It gets faster. Similarly, when people started walking together on the Millennium Bridge, their frequency matched the frequency of the bridge and the bridge started to sway a little first because the cables of the bridge were attached to the side, hence the movement of the bridge. Because of this sideways movement, people also started walking sideways to balance themselves and then due to resonance, the movement of the bridge became faster and faster like a swing. When this problem was properly diagnosed, once done, Engineers installed a total of 89 shock absorbers on the Millennium Bridge, 37 to dissipate energy and 52 to control vertical movement, tested by the company. The company arranged more than a thousand people and ran them on the bridge. This test is considered to be the world's largest bridge beast. It is much more difficult to predict the visible connection between two or more bodies. The sound comes out together. But if they feel threatened while sitting on the hive, it flaps its wings together. As can be seen in this video, so now, we have gotten some interesting knowledge about synchronization and story of Millennium Bridge. Synchronization in found everywhere. So do an experiment for unique synchronization and comment below the video. Your appreciation is our goal. Hit the like and share the video with your friends.